Hi guys, look at you here. And oh, <gasps> Wendy's just released the new SpongeBob Krabby Patty collab burger for the TV show's 25th anniversary. So let's go to Wendy's and order up. I don't see any Krabby Patty sign yet. Today is October 2nd, so it releases on October 8th officially so I'm, we might have an exclusive look on it hi could i get the krabby patty combo single double oh single single combo yes could i replace it with the pineapple under the frosty please? pineapple vanilla yes wait maybe i can put this in my my pocket oh yes it fits Order number 1009? Yes. Thank you. Let's head home and try this Krabby Patty. And we are back from the Bikini Bottom. Oh, or Wendy's in Canada. Now, let's do a little unboxing, shall we? First glance, though. Do you see the packaging? Wendy's, come on. Use some of the tax dollars to improve your packaging. I expected a SpongeBob, beautiful SpongeBob painting on this, but no, just a typical cardboard bag. Okay, we first got the Wendy's Pineapple Under the Sea Frosty. We also got some French fries, a small. Mm, nice and soggy. We got a burger. We got another burger. A fork. Why do we have a fork? Oh yes, I ordered Cinnabon pull aparts. Interesting. Okay, so basically I bought a Dave single and the Wendy's Krabby Patty collab burger combo. So I'm not sure which one's which because this one says chicken, this one says hamburger. So we will see because what makes the Krabby Patty Burger so special is that it comes with a special sauce. Let's open it up and see. Oh, no, this one looks like the Dave's single. Oh, and this one looks like the special sauce. Now the Krabby Patty Burger comes with two slices of cheese on top of the thingy, what is this called? A patty, and on the bottom of the patty. Let's just take a bite first. I'm really excited. Uh, oh, we also have a special guest today. All the way from the Bikini Bottom, we got SpongeBob. Thank you, SpongeBob, for being on our show today. Yes, I know you're a busy man flipping burgers at the... I forgot that shop name. What's that shop name? Krusty Krabs. Took a while. All right. <laughs> Tastes like a hamburger, a cheeseburger. I can taste more tanginess. I believe that's from the sauce. Oh, very saucy. Let's try the sauce. Yeah, just tastes like tomato, not tomato, ketchup, mayo, Thousand Island. Big Mac sauce, basically. Hmm. Get a nice crunch from the onions, pickles, a nice tanginess. Pretty juicy. Now let's uh, try the Dave single to compare because there has been some controversy over this burger. Yes, over on the Reddit. People have been saying, because, oh, there was someone that posted a worker, a Wendy's worker. He posted a flyer that was only for the people working at Wendy's to see, but he, he leaked it to Reddit and he got fired. But on the flyer, it says what's in the Krabby Patty burger as well as a special new release. But the people in the comments, they're like, it's just a Dave single. For those of you that don't know what Dave single is, it's a quarter pound 
beef patty, fresh, never frozen, mayo, ketchup, pickles, onion, lettuce, one slice of cheese compared to the Krabby Patty that has two slices of cheese and a special sauce. All right, let's try the Dave single. Tastes like Dave is single. All right. Give Miku a little burger patty because she's been so good. Give this video a like, and if we get to 200 likes, you can give Miku a roasted piece of squash at the end of next video. <gasps> Honestly, can't really taste the difference between the Krabby Patty and the Dave single. Yeah, the secret Krabby Patty sauce tastes like Big Mac sauce. So, if you're craving a Big Mac and you don't have any McDonald's near you, get the Krabby Patty <laughs> from Wendy's. By the way, apparently, Krabby Patties are vegetarian in the show. Meanwhile, they collabed with Wendy's and made a burger with beef. So not very accurate. The story doesn't add up. You know, it's like reading a really good fiction book and then going to the movie theater to see the movie and it, it doesn't match, all right? And you're disappointed. Sort of like this. Now Spongebob himself on the show says that the Krabby Patty is made up of... Tell me. Spongebob, tell me. Oh. Yes, yes. It's first bun, then patty, followed by ketchup, mustard, pickles, onions, lettuce, cheese, tomatoes, and a bun in that order. The Wendy's Krabby Patty does not contain ketchup or mustard, like Spongebob said, but it has a secret sauce. And according to a Reddit user who is a manager at Wendy's, he says, but it's just a mix of mayo, ketchup, and mustard. It also says seasonings, but doesn't say what it is. Nonetheless, I think it's pretty tasty. Can't go wrong with a, a juicy burger with Big Mac sauce, essentially. Now, let's dive into the price really quick. Dave Single is $6.99, and the Krabby Patty just by itself is also $6.99. So, at least the price, at least they don't jack up the price like someone else, McDonald's. One thing the creator of SpongeBob did say, he said that he actually didn't like fast food, so he didn't want the Krabby Patty to come to life in real life. But sadly, Steven Hillenburg, the creator of SpongeBob, passed away in 2018 but is today today is 2014 so six years later nickelodeon went against his wishes and <laughs> collabed with wendy's to produce the krabby patty in real life which is not what the creator wanted think of that what you will now let's move on to the star of the show, actually. This is the Pineapple Under the Sea Frosty. This is what's actually special, all right? Because this pineapple is SpongeBob's house in the TV show. So we're eating SpongeBob's house. And for those of you that don't know, it's like a soft serve ice cream. And this one has a special pineapple concoction on the bottom. Oh, maybe we should mix it up. Oh, it's very liquidy. Oh yeah. Mm. Tastes pineapple-y and mango-y. Very tropical. I actually got a, a little glimpse of how they made the Frosty. They use Minute Maid specialty syrups and the garden is called Pineapple Mango Puree Syrup Blend. You know, if you got like mango puree, Mixed with pineapple juice, it tastes like that. Let's try it with the uh, french fries dipped in it. <laughs> you always have to dip your fries in a frosty. Tastes like sweet fries. Let me know in the comments if you plan to try this Krabby Patty. 
As for the Cinnabon pull aparts, I'll be saving that review and posting it exclusively on my Patreon. So, link in the description if you want to check it out. And a big thank you to Seymour Plant, Twice, Tom F, and Richard H. For your super thanks donation last video. And to my Patreon members, Executive Chef Seymour Plant and Darren P. An extra special thank you to Master Chef Sunshine and everyone shown on the screen. You helped us purchase these lovely Wendy's Krabby Patty Burger for everyone to enjoy. So thank you. Miku gets juicy watermelon. Eat. Yummy, right? And if you're still here, comment, I'm a Krabby Patty to confuse everyone.